Hey guys, what's up? Ty Ty the Gamer Guy here, and welcome back to some more Super Mario Sunshine. In the last episode, we explored Noki Bay for the very first time, and we also got the 100 coins and the blue coins of Gelato Beach. In this episode, we're gonna be, we're gonna be exploring Noki Bay even more, and then we're gonna tackle another 100 coin mission and blue coins of Peanut Park. Which will hopefully be the last 100 coin mission and blue coins that we do, at least for a little bit. But anyway, before we go back to Noki Bay, I want to talk to these pianos over here, because these two are funny. I'm telling you, my tree on my head is way taller than yours. You're crazy, my tree is much bigger, my leaves are nicer too. So yes, these two are having an argument over whose tree on, on who, oh, over... Ugh. These two were having an argument over whose tree on their head is bigger. When I was a kid, I didn't catch on. I didn't catch on to that. I thought that these two were comparing over um, these two trees over here. I thought they were talking about these two trees and not the trees on their heads. That didn't click until years later. And just for, and just saying, like, is a Pianta? Are Piantas comparing the size of their trees the same as you know? people concising this comparing the size of their dicks or something I don't know I don't, I, I don't want to think about it anyway so let's just go ahead and forget what I said right there and let's go back into Noki Bay mission three red coins in the bottle and there's grandpa grandpa is awesome I've got it, yes, I surely do have it. What have I got? Why, the answer to our polluted ocean problem, of course. And the answer is you. You must go to the ocean floor. Of course, that is impossible for you at the moment. Therefore, I've made an area for you to hone your skills. I didn't have time to read the text because it was automated right there. Wear this and you can stay underwater for much, much longer. You literally just put a fishbowl over my head. You're just asking for me to suffocate from doing that. Use that flood to move around and get red coins. But don't overdo it. If you run low on air, here's what you do. Just grab some regular coins and refill your meter, okay? So yes, we use coins to refill our breath meter. We're inhaling metal to get more breath. <laughs> Mario logic. And into the bottle we go. And like how it was like sitting on top of a platform where now it's like in the middle of nowhere in the sky. So yes, we now have a fish bowl on our head and it will allow us to hold our breath longer. But of course, because it's a literal fish bowl on our head with no oxygen tank, we will run out of air eventually. So yeah, this is a simple eight red coin mission. Just grab all the eight red coins in in this bottle. There, it's not hard at all. All right, and number three, number four, and I believe number five and six is right over here. So when to grab that one, and then once you get close to the sign, this will happen. It shoots you up like a rocket. Don't know the how that happens, but it does, and it's cool, but oh well, anyway. Then the last two red coins, well, there's one in this little hole, and then one on this tiny, tiny block, and oh, hold, really quick. Something I want to show really quick is that if you, hold on. How do I, like, zoom in or whatever? Whoops. There's the, something cool that you can see inside one of these holes. Come on, I want to show it. If I can't even show it. Can I, like, not even show it? Alright, fine game. I'm not going to be able to show it. Basically, like, if you, gl if you can glitch the camera inside... Um, inside the wall, and you'll be able to find this book that's under that's just sitting under there. Don't know why it's there, but it is. 
All right. Grab the last red coin and bam. Easy shine spray. And then again, I didn't really talk about this early, but when you're in water with the fishbowl on your head, you can use the hover nozzle to get to higher ground. Or I guess higher in the water, because we're, you know, we're in water. Anyway. Shine Sprite number six, and actually, hold on. Might be able to show off something somewhat new. Now that we have 60 Shine Sprites. And, oh, yep, here we go. Once you get 60 Shine Sprites, it will now be completely daytime in Delfino Plaza. No darkness in sight. So, that's cool, I guess. That's really about it, so let's just go back to Noki Bay. In mission four, Ely Mouth's Dentist. And, uh, I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to your awesome grandpa. Oh, Mario, finally setting out for the ocean's bottom. Grandpa's waiting for you up top. Oh, don't forget to wear this. You can use this rope as a shortcut to reach grandpa. And why are you putting this fishbowl on my head now when I'm... When I'm in, um, when I'm above the water where I need literal oxygen to breathe, they're just really asking for me to suffocate just by doing this. All right, whatever. Anyway, he says we need to find his grandpa, and he's up here somewhere. Come on, where's grandpa? I want to talk in that epic voice again. There he is. What's up, old man? And wait, does he only have one arm? Oh, his other arm is behind him. I thought, he, I thought he was missing an arm. You look like you're ready. The gunk in the ocean is caused by a giant eel. It's moved into our ancestral home at the seafloor, and it's nursing some nasty cavities there. Let's take a look. The newly uncorked waterfall created a gap in the pollution that you could use as an entrance. Jump right in there. Dive to the bottom of the ocean and clean that eel's teeth. Doing so will ease his pain and he'll return from whence he came. No doubt about it. Now gather your courage and dive. You heard, Grandpa. Let's dive. Oh god, my throat hurts after doing Grandpa's epic voice for some for a while. <coughs> All right, and now we are at the ocean floor, and we have a unique boss fight. So yes, thank God that Goopa Blooper is not the only boss fight in this in this place, because you know we've already fought him two other times before that. Anyway, my sensor shows highly toxic materials poisoning. You have sensors for poison. Why didn't that, like, activate much earlier, like, in the game? Because, I mean, the graffiti is like poison, I guess. And it was right here we have, indeed, Ely Mouth. I like how he has, like, two sets of eyes. Like, one that looks male and the other that looks female. And see, so, yeah, just like Grandpa told us, his teeth are covered in poison. Yeah, your teeth are so freaking dirty, they polluted an entire ocean. And oh boy, he'll eventually do this inhale attack, and if you fall in, he'll just he'll just chew you up and spit you back out. Yes, it, oh, I am getting low on health. There's a ton of coins if you need if you um, need to um, refill your, uh, whatchamacallit, you know, the air meter, and yeah, I, uh, yeah, let's just grab some more coins <laughs> before I die. So yes, now that we're talking about this, is that uh, when I first um, fought, got to this boss, it scared the crap out of me, cause like one of the things I was like, like, something I always thought was terrifying as a kid was like being in the ocean with like something as big as this just some coming after you, cause I mean like you're you're at a constant disadvantage in this situation. I, I remember that, like, that, like, I was, like, 
trapped in a game or something, and then like, I was fighting like an underwater boss, and it was like a giant eel or a giant shark, and it was coming after me, and I woke up crying. Uh, it, that's just scary, because like you're literally always at a, at a disadvantage in a situation like this. You can't breathe on the water. You have you have limited movement. All right. Anyway, let's clean off his teeth. And I think we only have one more tooth to go. Oh no, there's one over here that I missed. Oh! All right. Let's get some more coins, and then give him a good cleaning. I love this boss music. Like, it sounds funny, but also intimidating at the same time. Oh, God, no, 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 no! Do not want... No! Well, uh, that was weird. I didn't even come out of his mouth! What the hell happened there? All right, he's gonna do his little spinning attack. All, all that does is just make me waste air. Just come on, just come up here so I can clean your teeth. He doesn't even come up all the way. And wait, I thought one of his teeth was uh, close to being clean. He made it dirty again. All right, fine. Apparently, Ely Mouth is in pain and like he doesn't mean any harm. It's just, it's just that his teeth are so freaking dirty that they polluted all the water in Noki Bay, and he's just, like, sitting here, just, I don't know. I mean, if you're in pain, I doubt trying to eat me would try to help it any. Uh. No! Come on. Clean this. Alright. Yeah, just cleaning that tooth just makes up pop out, and he has one golden tooth, too. Alright, come on. Stop making me waste time. And air. And, of course, you will take damage if you touch those um, bubbles, because, I mean, they're literal poison. So, yeah. Anyway. One more tooth to go. Come on. We're almost there. No! I've come too far to be someone's lunch! Oh, whoa, that was weird. Come on, and... Come on! How'd that water not hit it? No, don't... No! no. Ah! Epic voice crack! Come on! So close! Yeah! Remember to take proper care of your teeth. Yeah, listen to floods. Listen to flood kids. Trust me, cavities are not fun. His golden tooth falls out and it turns into a shine spray. You see, no wonder your tooth was hurting. You had a whole shine spray stuck in your teeth. And oh, how cute! He left a trail of coins in the shape of a heart. All right, as we now we are just going to descend very slowly and grab the next shine sprite. And then we're going to do the 100 coins of blue coins of Peanut Park. So, I'll see you guys in just a bit.
All right. Now that that's over, we are now completely caught up. No more time traveling in these next couple videos. All right, so we are now completely done with four levels. We only have a couple more to go. Noki Bay is just one of them. All right, well, I guess I'll see you guys next time where we will continue exploring more of Noki Bay. I'll see you guys next time.